lot of pictures. Got some trains here in the old train. And Or just a thing like everybody wants something different. Yeah. Yeah. Got an old wooden, you ever see a wooden uh, 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 mop bucket? This one here is a wooden mop bucket. They're all wood. Usually they're all metal, but this one's all wood. Uh, oh man. Shame in here, y'all. Yeah, man. This is my dad's house, man. This dude, like, because my dad had a hard time. Uh, his leg got, like, you know, he had diabetes and he lost one of his legs, right? So, uh, this other person moving in here now to help take care of him, man. And, uh, yeah, man. You're just kind of sad. It's, uh, place never looked like this guys I swear I haven't been here for few man about three or four months man you know I just haven't been around man. this is where we used to have our picnic guys right here yeah man look at the table it's dilapidated <laughs> oh jeez. yeah man this was our picnic grove. <laughs> it's crazy to think that, uh, man, three, four of the people that used to come here at the picnics are gone, man. I lost so many people. And, uh, I really don't know what's left, man. I told you I would come to my dad's farm. Now, y'all, look. Farm I used to live on is down that way. Uh, maybe I'll try to uh, go for a little walk. And uh, I'll go for a little walk, guys, and uh, try to show you, uh, if I get a chance to, uh, where the house was that I grew up at. Actually, that house, it got hit by lightning. And uh, all that's left is the property. Now, this is where we used to cook. <laughs> See, we used to cook out here. This is kind of sad, guys. Have y'all ever left your parents' house for a while and then come back and and it's just not the same, guys? And it's a, it's a shame I remember swimming in that pool for real. I'll have to, I'll post a video. Um, it's going to be pictures from the past, of course, you know, but uh, of us swimming in this pool. This used to be a really cool pool, guys. Yeah, man. This whole journey of life, guys. It's really sad. Look at this pool now, guys. It's really sad to see this. And my dad, he, uh, like I said, it's hard to see him without one of his legs, too, man. I was there uh, when he had the surgery, but, uh, I went and visited him in the hospital. But to be honest, I really haven't been around that much. And I feel guilty as hell about it. All right, y'all, I'm, I'm gonna give you a close up of what the property looks like now. And there's my dad's uh, rent for his little motor scooter thing. Ain't this terrible, guys? <laughs> it's so sad. I had so many fun times in this pool, guys. It's amazing what happens in life, isn't it? Yeah, I'm gonna post some videos of, or, uh, you know, some pictures. Of, maybe I'll just post some pictures in my community post. Show y'all what uh, what it used to look like. There's a little pool house. All right, guys, I'm gonna uh, go in the house and uh, I'll get my dad on video. I don't know if I'm gonna formally introduce y'all, but. Uh, I'm going to try and get him on video so y'all can see him. Uh, I don't know how he will feel about it on YouTube, so I might not say anything. But, uh, all right, guys. You ready to meet my dad? Yeah, man.
Oh, he's out there talking to that guy. So. Yeah. Yeah, there's a chair right there. That's a cool lamp. Was that Shirley's lamp? Yeah. Not cowboys, huh? <laughs> No, it's not a cowboy. It the like cowboy is that's got a out. cowboy hat right there. That's yeah. Oh. There was that Frank's stuff. Yeah. <laughs> and then I bought that. Frank had one. I would have bought it, but uh, mm -hmm. he sold it. And I found that uh, radio uh, record player. I like that little and cowboy. I still got all the records downstairs. The next uh, project is going to be him cleaning out that cellar. <laughs> Bad like that. Make little, a little apartment down there. I like the little cowboy. He's cool. Yeah, well, you can have anything I got. Anything <laughs> I got to give you. <laughs> uh, yeah, sorry I haven't been around, but uh, I was feeling pretty bad, so I'm starting to feel a little better. I didn't really? even, I really, honestly, I didn't even leave the house for four or five days. Yeah, well, you yeah. just. Make sure you don't. You know, that's the handicap ramp. There is where it's overgrown right here. And that overgrown. Mike could probably do that with a. Uh, uh, Yeah, man. So, like, now y'all, I introduced you to him, y'all. Coming over here to get a little thing for him. He sent me over here. Uh, oh, is this one of their uh, post it? Is this one of their post it things? You want it in the trash can out there? All right, guys. Yeah, my. Uh, anyway, I hope y'all enjoyed the, the little introduction to my dad. I, like I said, I didn't know. Uh, I didn't tell him like 100% that uh, I'm gonna put this on YouTube or not. But I just wanted y'all to see where I'm. What I came home to, guys. <laughs> it uh, it's hard to get used to, to be honest. Anyway, uh, showing y'all a little, uh, you know, the more sensitive side of shaming, the sensitive side of sexy cowboy. And y'all, don't think I'm a sissy for showing on my sensitive side, right? Because, yo, there ain't nothing more sexy to the ladies than a man with some sensitivity. <laughs> yeah, man. Yo, hit me up in the comments if you're a girl, you know what I'm talking about. And, uh, let me know. Ain't that the truth, baby? I know y'all feel a man with sensitivity. Yeah, man. Yeah, y'all. Women love God that's sensitive and romantic. Oh, yeah. Alright y'all, much love. Peace baby babies, peace.